once again, I'm here at Dracula, we have all kinds of critters. I'd like to tell everybody why we uh, we had to close the petting zoo temporarily. Um, we're a nonprofit. We take care of uh, hand-raised, uh, named pet farm animals that are misplaced or need homes. We bring them in. We've had a nonprofit for over 10 years in Bruce Art. So we're very passionate about the care of our, our animals and what we do to the point we donate this to the jockey lot and to the public every week. Um, for a couple of weeks, we brought a bottle baby that we have been medically taken care of to perform, keep it alive because it was neglected, going to die. So we had it out here. Um, now, I don't have signs up that says we're a nonprofit rescue. That I don't have disclaimers on my animals to say that they're sick. I'm sorry. I apologize for that. But we've had multiple people... Um, that don't know the, the philosophy of, if you don't have nothing nice to say, please don't say it. And we've had some criticisms about my animals. My only defense is, if you're gonna hurt my feelings about my animals that I care a lot about, I just won't bring them out here and donate them to I'm, I don't have any interest in being nice to people that are hateful to me. It's just not part of who I am. So, for now, we will, not bring these out here for free just to let I, I want people to understand how hurt i was by these hateful people saying this stuff um and not asking a question first if you don't like people's stuff then just pass by don't you don't have to put your two cents in nobody cares about it necessarily um we do a lot of good things for good people so please um when we bring the animals back, I will have big disclaimers saying that um, this is a nonprofit. We do this, and this is free. This is I donate this to the public to say that this is the only free thing in Lafayette, Louisiana. So please um, understand what we're doing and where it comes from, because we take a lot of pride in animals. So thank y'all. Have a nice day. We're looking forward to everybody coming back when they're back. Thank y'all. Thank you, folks. So they say you're going to be modeling all these things, right? You're going to be the clothes model? Are you sure? I thought I heard that, that you're going to be modeling all, all these. You're selling t-shirts, right? You're going to be selling t-shirts? You're going to be doing some muscle poses? No? Something like that. Something like that. All right. Well, that's good. Right across from my booth, folks. This is a new addition. The Jaka. We'll see how it does. Next to the great 212. Haha. <laughs> you know what that is? No. Animorph the word to break the word down. It means animal and morph it means it changes into things. It comes right down to it's not a real animal and it doesn't really change anything because it's a big animal. <laughs> it's designed to sell you buy and sell a cage. Oh, <laughs> Look, you buy the cage, I throw the animorph in for free. <laughs> yeah. I just love doing that. These are peanuts. Not the good kind to eat. But this is Mr. Peanut, and these are the peanuts that we have, the, excuse me, the peanuts, the icons 
Funko Pops, come on down to the great 212 and pick out your icon. Now, folks, if you love this girl, if you love these ladies in still pictures, you're gonna love them in moving pictures. Here they are, in live and in person. Come on down to the great 500 section where you can come to. This must be the place. Ladies and gentlemen, there she is, the vendor of the month. Congratulations. <laughs> Couldn't happen to a better person, I'll tell you. And this is her wonderful shop. You've got to come and see her. What's your booth number, hon? 116, 114. 116, 114. She'll come over here, she'll play you some beautiful music, and if you're very fortunate, you'll sing for them too, won't you? Especially if they pay cash. <laughs> <laughs> so come on down to the great ones in 116. Here at Jockey Lot. And congratulations once again to our vendor of the month. Yes! No, no, no. Hi, I'm sure at Jockey Lot. What are so getting to? Yeah, you want to go look at it? It's right over there. All right, let's go. I'm going to leave Here's the man who knows something how to fish. Hey, Sally, you're a good fisherman. Wow, these are looking nice. You catch more fish with these? Absolutely, I can catch more fish than you, Bobby. Wow. You know, I like you. You know why? I think you and I kind of look alike. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, you know my brother, you know my brother, Dr. Goody? His name is Logan. I'm Lucas. Anyway, I wanted to use this as an opportunity. To go to the cutting room. I, you know, I just got back from Hollywood. I moved to Hollywood. And hey. I did. I did make it. No, the my coffee. What's that? Oh, you know, Oh, there's the fish. All kinds of good things here. Well, I gotta come see you again. Wow! Look at all the t-shirts. I bet you got you got t-shirts that fit me. <laughs> You know, I don't wear t-shirts so often, but sometimes I, I like your t-shirts. They're all over the place. And you know, you're right next to Doc over there. That one of good on you. Oh, is that right? Does he bother you? He bothers me. <laughs> but my brother likes it, so that's all that matters to me. All right, well, it's nice to meet you. You're, and you're David? I thought so. I got some accurate information. What's his this, name? This is, oh, I'm Lucas. I'm Lucas Goody. I'm actually... I'm actually my brother's, I'm a veterinarian, just like my brother. I just got, you know, I just got back from Hollywood. I went to Hollywood to be a star, and I, I didn't make it. They didn't take me to Hollywood, so I, put a, I came back home and so I surprised my brother. Lot, huh? Oh, yeah. Well, anyways, nice to meet you. Nice people here. I got to come here to drop you out more often. Someone said... Someone said, oh, where you at? Oh, there. Are you, are you, are you, that you're the birthday girl? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can you believe? You don't, you know, you don't, you don't look like you're a hunter. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to be here. That's what he told me. He lied to me. He probably lied to you, too. Thank huh? you, Doc. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway. Bye. Well, anyway, Lo Lucas, Lucas, you're going to get me in trouble. Anyway, there's two fine people at Jocka. He don't come very often. Uh, you, you probably met my brother, uh, Dr. Goody Logan. I'm Lucas. That looks good. Last time I was here, he told me to come get a drink. Like, I might just come back. <laughs> anyway, it's, it's, good, it's good seeing you all. You too. Wow. Doc, this is a nice store. I, oh, you got a friend there. Oh, hi, Denzel. Oh, she doesn't, she doesn't, she doesn't remember me. Oh. Anyway, this is a store. And you got a TV? Wow. Come see me at 212. What's that? 212? Okay, let's go. I'm sure Jackie not good at showing you the heading zoo. Yeah, you want to go look at it? It's right over there. All right, let's go. So this is this is Logan. This is Logan. You know, you know my brother's name is Logan too. 
He said, he said you had a brother. You have a brother named Lucas? Yep. That's my name. I'm Lucas. You know, we might be related somehow. Well, Logan, Logan's got some real nice stories. Logan, tell us a little bit about your store, all the things that you have here. So, all kind of games. All kind of games. You didn't even sell them to me? Yep. Oh, wow. Look at all them games. These are just some of the games that you hear at Deja Vu. If you've been here before, well, you probably have been here before, but it's just... It's like Deja Vu all over again. Yeah, that's an old line. Oh. You know, I used to, I just got back from Hollywood. You know, I went to Hollywood to be a star. Well, I, and I didn't make it. I'm gonna come home. I'm gonna surprise my brother Logan. You think yep. that'll work? Yep. <laughs> oh, thank you for being, thank you for letting me be, to visit you. Nice to meet you. Well, there we have all the vendors. And uh, let's take a look at the vendor of the month. We're right here. Go check out the vendor of the month. There he is. Hey. Hey, how are you, so congratulations being the vendor of the month. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I just <laughs> and I'm, I want to I don't want to put you on my channel. Oh, what channel you know, is that? It's called Doc at the Barn Snyder. I, I do jockey lot and I do my own stuff and everything like that. But I, I was a vendor once. So you're the vendor of the month. So <laughs> congratulations, thank folks. Thank you. Appreciate and, uh, it. You're at booth, what booth are you at? 400. Move your mask down so I think and read your lips. 400. Go right ahead, it's 400. Thank you very much, folks, and we'll... Here we are in the 400 section. The food court. Everything just continues on. It's big, it's spacious. If you can't find it here, you probably don't need it. <laughs> There's the new section down here in the 700. Food here? Pretty good food? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, all right, sounds good. This is $7, my brother. Old fashioned pound cake, yeah? How you doing? You over here in this corner now, huh? I am. Oh, and you and you keep them cool, right? Yes, sir. Uh, that's good. <laughs> you got some good food. What's that? You got some good food. There you go. There you go. All kinds of wonderful things here at the Jockey Eye. You can even get, you can be happy with a cucumber sandwich. Oh. And your favorite beverage, isn't that right? And you're, and you're allowed to buy more than one lime here, right? You can buy as many as you want, right? What a, what a great arrangement. That's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> well, folks, that was fun. And the flea market's a very interesting place to go. And, and it does make up a good percentage of our business. But, of course, we sell people, we sell things online to people. And we'd like to use this as an opportunity to thank just a few of them. And uh, encourage you to, to buy our, at Ijaki and also our online store at Dock at the Barn. You know, it's, I just never know who's going to show up in the up at the barn. Who are you? See? My name is Golden Sullivan. Really?
And uh, why are you you related to Doctor Goody? Oh no, no, I I'm a patient, a patient. Yeah, I uh, this is this, I I usually like this lie. He he's right now he's talking to his brother on the phone. Really? Oh, that's good. He he like he misses his brother. I know. He's always he wants the always. Uh, I I flew him. He wants to fly him somewhere, but you know. I try and hear I have a troll flying. Well, Gordon, I tell you what. Uh, since you're here, you wanna you you wanna stick around as I thank some people. Well, I think that would just decently smashing. All right. Well, we want to thank Tina of Ohio, Florida. She got this Jewel baseball shirt put out by Jewel and uh, and. Uh, it's no doubt going to help her in with the game. And then we'd also like to thank, let's see. Oh, you got notes. Yeah, <clears throat> that's the ship. That's the shipping lane. Oh, well, you want to read that? I think that's Spanish. I think so, too. That's why I wanted you to read it. Well, anyway, it's uh, Alejandro <laughs> Milpapas, California. He got the Los Angeles, Los Angeles baseball hat. It's a wonderful hat. In fact, this is a picture of what it looks like. And uh, we just, you know, there's nothing there. It's just the camera. Oh. Uh, anyway, we want to thank, we want to thank you for the order. And thank you for it. you a guest. Uh, oh, the doctor's calling you. I got to go. All right. Goodbye, Gordon. Gordon Solomon. Like a wise man. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, Joy. Bye bye. Hoo ya! Hoo ya! Ho ho! Edward Cullen! That's not who, that's the, that's the pop. The pop of the Twilight Saga. E.K. of Newbury Park, California. So, E.K. EC, or Ed Collins, is on his way to you. Thank you for the order. And I just want you to know, you got it a very good price because, um, as you know, it's vaulted and, and uh, it's very popular. I had it for one day, and you got it. Okay, we want to thank Kimberly, who got the Gunnar Peterson's Core Secrets. That's a picture of it right there. And also, we want to thank Misty. Misty got this little action figure. I can't remember who it is, but um, that's it over there. So thank you. Thank you, folks, for the orders. Well, hello, Christopher of Orlando, Florida. Christopher just called the cops. So Farva's coming out there. He's a super trooper. So you got in trouble in the neighborhood? He'll be there for you. Thank you for your order. Well, it's Sean hello, and, Joe. And Brooke and brought me to the convention. You in, so. You're in Santa Ana, California. Anyhow, and then I you saw something else while I typed in. Your, um, uh, hat to you. So, JW. Let me purchase. see what I did. I did. I'm going to go see me. Uh, this is John Eric. Oh, yeah. It's very good. Oh, kids. Doctor, Doctor Good asked me to do something for them, and Doctor Stein said, "Is okay? We got to thank." Three customers for three orders. But I don't have the orders here, I just have the name. So I'll be pointing up here for what they are. These are empty boxes, but they probably could be there. This one's going to Rico. Rico of Rico the Houston. Rico likes the Avengers. Rico's getting Tony Stark with the Iron Man. Yeah. And then Ooh, this is Amanda. Amanda, she, Amanda getting. What you getting, Manny? What you getting? Amanda's in Nebraska. She's getting Doc Holiday. I think he used to live out there. And then Alan. Alan. Alan is from Crestwell, Illinois. He's getting Jack Sparrow, a pirate. So, all those three, they're going to get those right up there. And you'll just see them pushed up there in the corner as, as, as I do it. So, I thank you very much for listening to me. And thank you for buying from the doctor. I'm 
so glad he let me help him out every now and then. Now let's see if I can turn this off. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I got it. That's right, we got some pop souls. Let's talk about Hawkeye. Hawkeye's going to Rico of Houston, Texas. Hawkeye. There he is. And we'll have Christopher. Christopher is against support funding, defunding the police. Especially this one. Anyway, congratulations for that, Christopher of Orlando, Florida. There he is to you from me. Be good.